Hello, uh, my name is Mariusz and to finish off the blockchain and cryptocurrency module for a digital forensics course, uh, we designed some simple Bitcoin and Ethereum tasks. Uh, in this particular section, you will be an investigator who needs to work out some of the uh, patterns or some of the behaviors that happened in, uh, in Bitcoin. To do that, we designed uh, uh, six simple tasks that you will uh, try to, to solve. Those are kind of formulated in a form of puzzles. Uh, the first, uh, you do need to know the Bitcoin and blockchain fundamentals, uh, how the blocks and transactions are organized, and a little bit about Bitcoin script. So the first task is simple. Um, you have to work out what is that. Um, and you have to find doing some, you know, Googling or social engineering. Uh, maybe you need to check some fora or maybe you need to look for some information uh, who was involved. The second one is fun. Uh, there is this famous uh, 10,000 bitcoins pizza. Um, so you should not have much trouble finding the Bitcoin transaction, which was the payment for the pizzas. So good luck. The third one um, is something first. So something happened for the first time. Um, the date is sort of, you know, easy to find. Um, you need to work out what happened. The fourth is similar. Um, you have um, something, you need to work out what it is. Uh, and then you need to look into what has happened and what is unusual about it. Um, was it a mistake or was it an intentional uh, behavior? And if you consider it as a intentional behavior, uh, why would you think that would be useful and for whom? Um, so how could that be potentially misused? Uh, so analyze it and check what is unusual about it and find out, try to find out the answers for the, for the questions. Um, so this one is a little bit um, more involved than the previous ones. Uh, you have to look at the, again, at something um, and find out what it is uh, and what has happened. So there is sort of the, the more to the story than initially meets the eye. So try to work out what exactly happened and how much money, how much value changed hands um, in this particular case. You don't need to work out who, uh, but only how much. All right, so this one is the most um, difficult one and the most interesting one, but uh, you may need to do a little bit more social engineering to kind of dig stuff in, like from it. Um, so again, you have given a sequence of uh, characters. You have to work out what it is. Um, and then what is what it was used for, and you have to work out the story uh, behind it. It has a couple of layers to the story, uh, and you try to work out the full story of exactly what happened. And um, if you want, you can also work out the details, the technical details of how the whole thing was set up. So uh, those are um, six cases that you will be working on and you will be trying to solve and trying to um, dig, dig out. Use Google, use uh, Fora, use uh, Reddit, use uh, whatever you can, use blockchain explorers uh, and try to work it out. All those cases involve Bitcoin. So you can uh, skip searching through some of the other chains which have the same, um, potentially they have the same, uh, uh, things. I don't want to spoil your fun. So uh, good luck and um, have fun with those. Thank you.